I find it a fairly kind of poignant picture of it. It's an elderly man in Witherspoon. We've blanked out his, his uh, face, obviously, to protect his privacy. Um, but apparently, he couldn't order a drink in his local mm. because he didn't have the app. Because, of course, everything has gone digital. Now, thankfully, another guy bought his drinks for him on their app. But there's just that Honestly. feeling of exclusion for people who haven't, you know, who are not tech savvy. I'll tell you what. Uh, ladies, this one really broke my heart. You know, it, there's more than 2 million people in England over the age of 75 who don't have access to the internet or any form of online um, access. And to think that uh, elderly people, uh, uh, people of this age, are feeling so segregated and isolated. We know this from how the fight regards to care homes and so on. And, and as a social worker, when I've worked with elderly people, it was always about trying to supply them with the needs that they needed that, that matched to the life that they had and now people have been stripped away from loved ones and now everything is online everything needs to be done for an app there's been no consideration for uh, people that are not used to it or for elderly people and we know that we need that social interaction if that guy wasn't there what would have happened he just wanted a simple drink and it, it really breaks my heart i mean it's a process that's been accelerated hasn't it i mean i think we knew we were going in the direction of, of tech but people were sort of getting the chance to get used to it but it's, i think what's happened in five years has happened in Mm. One. Mm. Well, now everyone says for everything it's because of COVID, even though sometimes when it does it, that does, it doesn't make any sense. Obviously, of course, a well, lot of it was, do, was done. The whole contactless for that. regime but it's like, was well, because. For example, I mean, I, I completely empathise with that man because. I would be that person waiting for someone mm. to come along and do it. But it's it's the frustration. It's like, today, I'm going to have lunch with somebody afterwards. And I must have had three emails from this restaurant to say, have you downloaded the app and have you posted, have you printed out the wow. guest's invitation? Wow. I just want to go up and go, hi, Denise Welsh and my guest, Tom, is coming to, jo to join me at the table. What's wrong with that? Now, my dad, who has really struggled um, in, in lockdown, like, mm. like many, many people are, being such mm. a social person and has been really, really um, poorly. Yeah. And as, he's, as his health has declined over this last year, he has really struggled with not being able to have people around to the house to do certain mm. things, um, you know, as, as regards ba banking and things like that. My dad actually is in, is in hospital in Newcastle. And I just want to say, love you, Dad. Sorry. Oh, well, we know how special your dad is. Yeah. Yeah. We know how special. It's just been dad. really, really I tough. Know. But I all know. of these things have just added to the fact that he can't understand. You know, it's yeah. the technology is just going at such a rate. I know. I, I just can't I know. keep up with it. I can't bear it anymore. Jane, how, how is your mum? How's your mum coping? <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, new technology is. It's like you know, space travel to me or something. My mum just can't do new technology. So she's lucky, she's got me, she's got her grandchildren. So, you know, we can, she'll sort of say to me, I've had this letter about, I've got to register online for this, that, or, you know, even the BBC licence mm -hmm. um, fee, mm -hmm. that's all, you know, they keep sending her letters and she just finds it really confusing. But she has me, but so many, so as many you don't. said, so many people would, don't have don't. anybody. And I would just urge from seeing it from, being a social worker, from being a carer with parents, I would urge anyone, everyone that's watching, please, if it's your neighbour, yeah. uh, uncle, a friend's yeah. parent, it, it's just a knock on the door in a safe way. If you're going out and you can get a few extra bits for them, yeah. just please, because I don't think people understand. These are How people that built the country, that yes. has given us a space for opportunities, cared for us. It's now time that we yeah. care for them. And we don't them. revere and, and our just, old people enough. Yeah, we just need to, to love them. Like yeah. the guy in the well, pub did. Well, absolutely. I mean, technology is undoubtedly a huge part of our lives, but that doesn't mean that we can't show humanity. Humanity, and yeah. You're absolutely right, G. That's yeah. a perfect way to put it.